As uh, the New York Fashion Week comes to a close, Indonesia is kicking off its own Fashion Week that promises to uh, a new look into the industry. Channel News Asia's Diviante Farids takes us behind the catwalk and the haute couture to find out that fashion is big business in Indonesia. When you think of fashion, this image comes to mind. But organizers of Indonesia Fashion Week say they want to do more than just attract fashionistas and designers. The daily fashion shows feature everything from high-end clothes to casual wear, men's wear, Muslim wear, and the exhibitions even have children's wear. The four-day event will also have fashion and trade exhibitions, a designer competition, workshops, and seminars. Indonesia Fashion Week bukan sekedar fashion show, bukan pameran, bukan hanya event, tetapi merupakan bagian dari perkembangan setiap tahun yang kita bisa mengukur dan melihat yang terbaik dari fashion uh, dan dari uh, produksi fashion yang atau mode yang ada di Indonesia. Indonesia Fashion Week, which debuted last year, is endorsed by the Washington-based Fashion Week organization. 500 local brands are on display alongside international fashion designers such as Melinda Loy and Camilla Welton. Bagian baju muslimnya bervariasi ya, gitu ya, lebih cik gitu kayaknya. I can see that uh, there are a lot of combination between uh, local content and maybe uh, the mix between West and East. Uh, for example, uh, they combine between cartoon or denim or jeans with uh, pure Indonesian fabric like batik, ikat, and the other's fabric. In 2012, Indonesia's fashion industry generated over 16.7 billion U.S. dollars in revenue and is the second largest contributor to the country's gross domestic product. It also employs almost 4 million people nationwide. Indonesia has ambitious plans to further develop its fashion industry. Four ministries, including the Trade Ministry, as well as the Tourism and Creative Economies Ministry, are working together to make Indonesia the center of fashion in Asia by 2018, the center of Muslim fashion by 2020, and one of the world's fashion hubs by 2025. Devianti Paris, Channel News Asia, Jakarta.